my July 2015 unboxing for Whistle Work Box, and this is an office subscription box. They send all kinds of office gear to your door uh, for $19.99 a month. They have a man's and a woman's box. This is the woman's box, and I was sent this for review. I'm not sure if there's any coupon codes, but as always, if there are, I'll include them down below. So, let's see what's in the box. So, right inside, right here, is the information card. It's just a sticker to the box tells you everything in the box and the retail value and there's a little note it says thanks for ordering whistle work box um, it's going to be a good day happy sailing so and I did receive this for review I didn't actually order it but um, so that's kind of the card that they include in everybody's box hopefully I can read this information card and unbox this at the same time okay So this first item is Dear Lizzie Watercolor Words, and looks like there are eight of them. And on the back this tells you what's in here, best ever, smile, today, dream, love this, hello, here, and hugs and kisses. So you can put this like if you have a, um, a push pin board or something at your desk, or maybe use um, Put it at the edge of your monitor. You can even scrapbook with these if you scrapbook. Um, obviously, that wouldn't be an office use, but you know, they're neat. Uh, let's see. This is oh, it's a um, stylus and an actual pen. So you can use this on your smartphone, tablet, anything like that at work, and then it also also doubles as a pen while you're in meetings. And it's a pretty color. Pretty nice. Um, this has a retail value. This has a retail value of $4. And I'm just going by their prices because obviously I can't look anything up. So, um, This is MSC Magnetic Bookmark. And it is pink and it has little turtles on it. Cute. This has a retail value of $4. Cute. I like turtles and pink, so that's neat. There are some hair ties. I actually love these things. And I know, like, some people might not like getting these in boxes because they do frequently come in boxes, but this is kind of one of those things that always disappears. This and sunglasses are the two things that I always lose. And I probably have 50 pairs of sunglasses and like 3 million hair ties around, floating around my house. But somehow, they always get lost. I don't know. I probably should clean more. But in uh, any case, I love getting these in boxes. These are great to have in your desk um, if you're working on something and you just want the hair out of your face. Slip one of these on um, from JP. And these retail for... Five dollars. Mm. All right. This is a summer anchor mouse pad. Um, retails for eleven dollars. Oh. Um, has an anti-slip pad. Um, it's cute. I, I don't. I wouldn't spend eleven dollars on it. Honestly, I don't even know. The last time I bought a mouse pad, so I really have no idea what they run, but $11 seems a whole lot for a mouse pad. Um, I mean, mine is like some weirdo company I got at a, like, food or like one of those fairs or whatever that they give you free mouse pads, so I haven't bought a really pretty one, but I, I mean, it's cute. It's just $11 seems really expensive for a mouse pad. Uh, I think we're selling some little bonus goodies. So there's some like Jolly Rancher candies and a snack clip. This has a magnet on it. It's kind of just clear plastic. So these are just kind of like some freebies thrown in there. Okay, this is a Kawaii Whale Bone Holder. And you just sit this on your desk and you can sit, sit your phone right here. I don't think my phone will work. I have a big otter box, so that's the price you pay if you're being cautious. Um, 
this will fit like a regular phone if you don't have I mean maybe if you have like a small case on it it would probably still fit but not my big otter box so I might just give this to my kids to play with in the bathtub um, I want to be able to use it and this last item um, is some sheets of paper and it's almost like scrapbooking paper um, retails for six dollars says you can make a summer banner, um, make a coworker a card, or a scrapbooking project. So maybe go well with the little words. So again, you can make cards out of them for people, or if you just want to get crafty, you know, on your lunch break or something, whip up some photos and you can craft. So that's neat. Seems to be some nice colors. Has the nautical theme. Kind of goes with the nautical theme of the mouse pad. Um, and that is everything in the box. So, $19.99. Yeah, it's alright. Um, I didn't love it. And maybe this, I'm still loving that very first box that they did. With like those space, co space coasters. I don't know if you all saw that video. I love that box. I thought it was like just awesome. Um, this one's definitely more, um, girly. I mean, it is the women's box. But, um, I mean, the hair ties are nice and... The book bar, kind of think it's nice. Nothing is super quirky and weird, which is one of the things I really liked about their first box. So, kind of depends on how you um, see it. I definitely think it has, you know, the 19.99 retail value. Although, like some of the values, like a question, I don't know if I said the cost of the paper. The paper was six dollars, which I know, like just from my own scrapbooking and things, like scrapbook and that kind of paper runs about that. So, I think that's accurate. Um, I have a bottom ass pad in a while, so we'll, maybe that's how much they cost now. It just seems eleven dollars is expensive to, for a mouse pad. But in any case, I mean, I think the value is there for the box. Um, I don't think it's a ton over nineteen ninety nine, to be perfectly honest. Um, I don't think it's my favorite box, but it was cute. So I hope next month is just more quirky. I love the quirky, like really unique things that. Um, like if you saw at someone's desk, you're like, oh, where'd you get that? That's so cool kind of thing. Um, so that's just me. What do you think? Leave your comments. I always like hearing your comments, the good, bad, the ugly. So, um, feel free to let me know what you think. That is everything. I will include my full written review down below at subscriptionboxmom.com. And that is everything. So thanks for watching. Have a great day.